Okay, y'all, I'm ready to cut the gossip and get straight to the game. Okay, is it just me? Are these Kardashians as weird as hell? I mean, Kim Kardashian went to the um, Cleveland Cla Cavaliers, excuse me, and Lakers game this past weekend. Like Tristan Thomas paid for the Cavs. Why would you go to a whole game where you know your sister's ex is going to be there? I mean, what is the issue with them? They love to pick. That's one thing that I noticed about them. They love to pick. And she actually stood up and booed him. That was such a waste of time to stand up and boo somebody. Like, and that's your date night. It was actually her and Kanye's date night. And you decided... To go to a game to boo your sister's ex. Really? Is that how you're spending your life? They loved irritation. And I noticed the same thing with her sister, um, Kylie. How she continues to keep on coming for Jordan. Like, let Jordan live her life. <laughs> That girl is on a trip. She's trying to have a vacation with her friends. She's posting pictures, and you back and forth with posting pictures with her. And and not to mention the sister, um, what you call it, Chloe. She is so tight with her sister's ex man, Scott. You know, Courtney's man. How you gonna be tight with your sister's ex man? I mean, I don't know about that, but something is weird about that family dynamic. She's friends, our best friends, with her sister's ex-man, Scott. Really? I'll tell you right now, I believe the only sane one in that, them, that family is Kendall. You really don't hear much from her. She's super quiet. She absolutely stays to herself. I mean, I'm not saying that she's not famous in her own right, but she conducts herself like an average American. Them women, they weird. The mama's okay. I haven't really seen too much out the mama. The mama's okay. But them girls, that that uh Chloe, that Kim, that Kylie, them, them three right there, they rub me the wrong way. Anyway, I just think it was just all so ignorant. And here's the game in this. You know, stop telling people. Because as well as you famous, you can lose your fame too. So this way you gain fame is the same way that you can lose fame. And everybody to me seems like they always let them pass the buck. They're always biting things, taking things from other uh, people, our culture, and try to make it their own. But I said what I said, and I meant what I said. You got to watch out for people like that. That's another part of the game in here. Stop biting off of people and watch out for people like that. Be cautious around people like that. Because to me, they know that they're famous. Even she got that skim line. They know they're famous, and they know people flock to them. And it's predominantly Caucasian Americans who want to be hip because they feel like, you know, the Kardashian is hip. But they're hip to me in the wrong way. You know, you're stealing and taking from other people, and that ain't the way to go. Anyway, I'm out. Spread love.